Okay, I just finished taping the uh, pruning and repotting of the boulevard cypress. So I have all this leftover pieces, right? And what I wanted to do was to show you this is a great place to learn your basics. Okay, so we got all this. Now, if you went to the nursery, it'll probably look like that. And in making a bonsai, you always want to have a single line. So you cut like this, right? And then cut like this. Still following me? And Now, basically we're looking for movement and taper. This lower one may or may not stay. This is generally considered like the sacrifice branch, but see, you go up this way, like that, like that, like that. And then this is the side branch, make it shorter. This just to fatten the area. Concept. There should be a line inside there, right? So I'm gonna clean up, clean up. Look for the line, look for the line. Oh, here it is. And then this one will most likely be a side branch. Shorten it, shorten it, clean it up, clean it up. Shorten it, and then up here, you wanna turn it again. And then this one here, just cut it off because it's too big. And then, okay. Well, it's kinda of hard to show you, but how about that? Does that look okay to you, right? See, it starts to, shape up into a bonsai. And all we're trying to do is to create a main line with movement and taper. So always emphasize movement and taper. Now, because this is a cutting, we don't have no root. Well, here's one of the big branches that I cut off. Let's see what we got in here. So take these off, take these off. Now this one is gonna be um, relatively uh, smooth line so it's not as uh, twist and turn like an informal upright so we're going to approach it like it would be a formal upright but see now we got this line that goes up here and cut these off Backside, we got too many branches, cut those off. And the beauty of this is no stress, right? Because it's just a piece of branch, especially these that's going to be thrown away. You might as well practice and do it fast. and let it become second nature to you. So, see that? And the other thing is, when you have a branch, you do the same thing. So this could be one of the big branches that are on a tree. So you learn to do that. So the branch itself should have a, a taper too. It shouldn't be chopped off like that. Stick it in a, a bonsai pot with sand, then you kind of visualize what you have in the future. The other one that uh, I did, the tall one, uh, relatively straight trunk, right? But only thing missing is the root flare, and you can't get that till you get a live plant. But you can see that this ex simple exercise is a great way to learn how to do it. Take what you're gonna throw away and practice. So this is Hero saying goodbye 
And hopefully you get a little bit out of this lesson. Well, hopefully you get a lot out of this lesson because this is one of the most practical way of practicing. You know, even when...